Welcome back to Jenks Library. In our last video, we looked at searching Jenks Library databases by topic. But what if your search is not yielding enough results? Here, I've searched for treatment options for persistent velar fronting. And even though I included like terms connected with the Boolean operator or, I still only have one result. In this video, we'll look at how to use public databases like Google Scholar and PubMed to access sources and make sure that those sources aren't stuck behind a paywall. Let's start by running the same search in Google Scholar that we were running in our database. You can see we have a lot more results here and open access sources are linked on the right. If you're searching in PubMed, you can narrow down to open access and full text available through Jenks Library. Here, I'm only seeing open access sources linked here, but I can customize my Google Scholar to also search Jenks Library sources as well. I'm going to head to the settings menu on the left hand side and select settings. Then I want to select library links and search for Jenks Library. I'm going to select Jenks Library to tell Google Scholar that I also want to search for sources available at Jenks Library. And now we can see that some of the sources that initially looked like we wouldn't have access, we can access through Jenks Library. One of the advantages of this beyond being able to get access to the full text is that we'll now have access to those same tools that we saw before where you can cite your sources and save permalinks and download as a PDF full text. 